Hey everyone. Today, we have an interesting challenge on our hands. So, a customer brought in this Western Digital external hard drive and it's making some concerning buzzing noises. Now, we don't want to plug this thing in and risk causing any further damage to the drive, especially since our main goal here is to recover the precious data that's stored on it. From our experience, the buzzing noise could be a sign that the drive head is stuck on the platter and we'll need to address this issue and get it up and running again. If you're wondering what that buzzing noise sounds like, it sounds like this. So we're going to walk you through the entire process step by step. We'll be heading into our clean room to open up the drive, inspect it, and if necessary, unstick the drive head. Okay, so we're in the clean room and we're preparing to open the drive. Remember, never open a drive outside of a clean room as dust can contaminate the platters, damaging the head and rendering the data inaccessible. We'll start by removing the tamper-proof labels and screws. Now, to open the drive, we'll use a Torx screwdriver to remove all the screws on the top cover. Then we gently lift the cover off. Now let's take a look inside. If our theory is correct, the hard drive head should be on the platter, and it is. As you can see, the hard drive head is resting on the platter, when it should actually be parked on the orange parking area. Clearly, it's out of place. So to remedy this, we'll manually move the head to the parking area. We'll need a pair of tweezers and a Torx screwdriver for this. So, we carefully turn the hard drive platter counterclockwise while gently guiding the head to the parking area. Make sure to be cautious, as any excessive force could damage the magnetic head or scratch the platter. Next, I'll use the green light to inspect the platter for scratches or particles. For us, everything looks clean and there's no visible scratches on the platter. Finally, we'll reattach the drive cover and secure it with the screws. So now that we've opened the hard drive, unstuck the head, and inspected the platter for any damages, we'll use one of the data recovery tools available at our recovery center. The PC3000 Portable is an advanced tool that allows us to access the drive and recover data from damaged heads, as well as diagnose any issues with the drive. To begin the data recovery process, we plug the hard drive into a USB port and run the software. Loading the software now, and we can see here the drive information. And we are able to access the data. So, checking some of the folders, and it looks good. I blurred the information for privacy reasons as we always care about our customer privacy. So now I'll go ahead and create an image and recover the data. We hope this video was informative and gave you a better understanding of the data recovery process. Thank you for watching.